15 signs you have a strong, intimidating personality. Certain aspects of you may lead people to take a step back, and they're not what you'd expect. People may be intimidated by your distinct and powerful personality. It has nothing to do with you and everything to do with how others see you if you have an intimidating demeanor. However, it's critical to be conscious of how others view you to have satisfying relationships and understand where others are coming from. Have you ever felt your personality mystifies your friends, acquaintances, co-workers, and close family members? You're left wondering what you did or said to make them take a step back. Your strong personality makes people apprehensive and uncomfortable around you, even if they don't recognize it. After watching this video to the end, you will discover a lot about your strong, intimidating personality. And you will also learn why people are intimidated by you and what you can do about it. Welcome to a new video from the Social Psychology Masters YouTube channel. If you are new here, subscribe for more social psychology videos. And comment down below, I subscribed, so we can welcome you, let's start. Number 15. You stick to your word. It refers to you being consistently true to your words, be the threats or promises you make. This personality makes people usually be conservatory around you. You're known for adhering to your principles even if others don't agree with you. Even if it appears unusual to others, you are confident in your ability to achieve your goals. While being someone others can rely on is a positive thing, many individuals are put off by the concept of doing what you say you'll do. This often makes others appear bad, and they might find you intimidating. Number 14. You have a strong personality and are opinionated. Being strongly opinionated means that you're adamant about doing something, even if it goes against what others expect of you. Most strong people have outstanding attributes like determination, faith, and confidence. Even though your arguments and beliefs scare others, you don't come across as arrogant. You're courageous for adhering to your principles even if others don't agree with you. Even if it appears unusual to others, you are confident in your ability to achieve your goals. You are not often swayed by what other people think because you have your mind. You're not afraid to question the status quo, which makes others feel scared or uneasy. Number 13. You are candid. You say precisely what you're thinking and you mean exactly what you say. You say what's on your mind, which isn't always well accepted by others. Being open and honest with others often requires expressing frank or forthright ideas. While you are merely attempting to be yourself, others may not be accepting of who you are. While you are under no need to be less open, it can appear great if you are less insistent about your beliefs with others. Number 12. You are principled. You are aware of your values and adhere to them. No one has the power to persuade you to do something that isn't morally correct. As a result, you are a better person than you believe you are. You are determined about your beliefs and find no reason to compromise them for anything or anyone. When making a decision, you check to see if it aligns with your values, you're curious, logical, and sensible, and new experiences enthrall you. You don't let your emotions govern you since you live by your values and logic. Number 11. You value honesty. When one of your distinguishing personality traits is honesty, you say what's on your mind rather than sugarcoating things. And you tell it like it is, even if it made others uncomfortable. You prefer to understand a topic before passing judgments, unlike other people who have a know-it-all attitude about things they don't know anything about. It irritates you when people speak without thinking. This is also why you can't stand stubborn ignorance and despise it when someone is quick to pass judgment. Number 10. You solve problems. Rather than wallowing in self-pity, you take action and seek out answers to your difficulties. Others will feel as if you are leaving them in your shadow. This is a fantastic mentality to have because it usually signifies you're willing to make amends after you've made a mistake. This attitude may intimidate people because the typical assumption is to first feel sorry for yourself when you're in a poor circumstance, and when they see you always striving to improve when you've been in a difficult scenario, it comes across as a frightening personality to others. Number 9. You are assertive. When you can work on strategies to acquire what you want, whether it's a raise, making a positive shift in your life, or anything else, so that you do not frighten others and do not alienate those around you, you must find strategies to avoid being aggressive and domineering. Match the speed of people in a conversation so they can offer their thoughts. Encourage people who are sensitive to you to speak up as well. 
inquire about others' thoughts or opinions so you may gain a better understanding of their perspectives. Strike the correct balance while taking into account the demands of others. All of this may be done in a direct, calm, and constructive manner. You have a strong assertiveness while remaining non-confrontational. Number 8. You are tenacious and steadfast. This is why you refuse to listen to, make, or accept excuses. Others find you intimidating because of your powerful personality. People perceive you as someone who wants results since you don't offer or accept excuses. You prefer to concentrate on what you can do and how to accomplish your goals. You should never make or accept excuses because they will keep you from living the life you desire. Don't be concerned or perplexed as to why you don't make excuses in your life. It's only that you're aware that you have reasons and options to pursue your goals. So when the world seems to be crumbling around you, keep your steadfast spirit. Continue to stand up and never back down. Number 7. You're a goal-oriented person. Motivated people with huge ambitions strive to be the best version of themselves. They are constantly striving to learn and achieve more. They are incredibly inspired, determined, and motivated to achieve their objectives. If you have these characteristics plus a strong go-getter mentality, it might be daunting to those around you. You have a confident demeanor that some people mistake for being arrogant, but you are not. People who are intimidated by your determination are those who do not have personal ambitions. They're either uneasy about themselves or lack the motivation to work toward their objectives. Number 6. You are good at reading others. Your intuition and instincts are powerful, and you have an uncanny ability to read people you've just met for the first time. According to research conducted by Princeton psychologists, making the first judgment of someone takes only one-tenth of a second. People are intimidated by it because they sense that you can read their minds. They feel nervous and unsafe in your presence. This is especially true for people who are dishonest, ignorant, or have hidden agendas. You may learn a lot about someone by monitoring and recognizing subtleties in their actions and facial expressions. You sometimes have an understanding of how their thoughts work as well. Use your ability to quickly read others to alter what you intend to say so that it is received as well as possible. Number 5. You hate chronic complainers. People who whine about life rather than getting up and living it aren't worth your time. You avoid people who have nothing better to do than complain about their lives. You're out there seizing life by the horns, and you're well aware that this might be daunting for others who are terrified of what would happen if they took the risk you've taken. When you are open and honest about your feelings, they will see that you lack empathy and are unconcerned about their problems. Of course this isn't the case. People are intimidated by how you seize life by the horns because you can deal with unpleasant issues directly and decisively. Chronic complainers might be bothersome, but they also require guidance. Number 4. You desire meaningful relationships. Do you select your mates with care? If you do, some people may find your selectiveness and pickiness scary. You are aware that adequately choosing your pals can be beneficial. You do it because you don't want to be around poisonous individuals. So you decide to spend your time and energy with people who will help you grow. You prefer fantastic folks who are optimistic, honest, and positive, as well as those who are simply amazing. You avoid toxic friendships since they can be draining and have a negative impact on your mental health. You know that spending time with genuine friends will make every moment of your life more enjoyable, tranquil, and meaningful. Number 3. You don't crave superficial attention. You don't do things or leg your life to attract the attention of others. You're happy and content knowing that what you're doing is correct and that it will help you achieve your objectives. You like to be recognized for your depth and genuine nature rather than seeking or receiving attention from superficial things. People are drawn to your distinctive appeal despite your low-key demeanor. One of the reasons is that you exude the self-assurance and resolve that most people aspire to. Number 2. You are fearless. While we all have anxieties, you have figured out how to deal with them and use them to your advantage. You never allow fear to get in the way of your goals or govern your life. You know you can beat the odds because you're prepared to meet the challenges that would otherwise fold you back. While most individuals are concerned about their worries, the way you view them may surprise you. You're aware of your surroundings and take solace in the unknown. Number 1. You know your stuff. You're smart and sassy, tough and resourceful, and you can stroll into a room and assess it for what it is while doing so. 
You can converse with people from all walks of life and carry on a discussion even if you don't understand what they're saying because you pay attention to what they're saying. Many people will not like this about you, but that is their problem. Rather than being appreciative of your smarts, some may demean you. However, don't let it affect you, continue to be yourself. Conclusion In everything you do, don't let other people's opinions shape who you are. Instead, they should help you improve at what you do. If you have made it this far, what do you think about this list? Is there anything you believe we might have missed? Let us know in the comment section below. To learn more, check out other videos on this channel and the links in the description. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.